So it's uh, November 15th. Um, on my left, I got my gyro fuyu. Um, and on my right, I have my chocolate. So chocolate has male flowers. So it always pollinates all my other persimmons. Um, that mix fuyus, like my gyro, become seeded. I um, slice it this way so you can kind of see the seeds. Uh, seeds quite, it's quite annoying, but I'm still testing, <coughs> excuse me, I'm still testing out my chocolate and um, this is the first time I've, I'm pretty impressed with just the color of a chocolate. Uh, it is a little bit annoying that it makes all the other persimmons seeded, but on its own, is it uh, worth growing? That That's my question. Um, so... You can see these are the seeds. Uh, there, there are quite a few seeds. I think at least six seed for the size um, persimmon. And it is a astringent variety. It means um, it has to fully ripen on the tree and has a little bit of give. That's when you pick it. Because if you pick it too early, it's going to be astringent, particularly the skin. So we're going to start off with my gyros. That's our baseline. See how it tastes. Oy. Oddly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Oddly, every time a astringent variety becomes pollinated, it seems to throw backwards and make it a non astringent, making it bitter. So it's fully ripened and um, it becomes an astringent and opposite of that is an astringent variety when pollinated by chocolate becomes non-astringent it's very confusing in that sense last year i wasn't sure but this year i'm like mm, okay the same results so i would say if you like just a fuyu type a non-astringent do not grow a chocolate or any other male flowering persimmon nearby. I don't recommend it. It's just not worth it. But now, let's just uh, eat our chocolate on its own. See if it's uh, worth all the trouble it causes. Wow. So, the astringent inside tastes great. Outside, it still holds the astringency. But if you're comparing the chocolate and the gyro right now, the chocolate tastes way better. So for me, I would say opposite. I would say, don't grow food use. Just grow chocolate. <laughs> Avoid all the troubles you may have. So, um... I think it's beautiful, it tastes great. The size obviously is not as big as I would like it to be. Um, I, I, I'm expecting something larger than this, hopefully it matures. Um, but the color is just so beautiful. If only we can just uh, get the, hold on. See how beautiful that, like how beautiful that looks just get over the astringency it, it has so I'm gonna try to peel the skin off to see inside see how happy I, I am texture wise it doesn't win it's um after frost and anything ripens it just ruins the texture for me. I uh, so this is chocolate's beautiful, but I still think um, my highest rating for persimmon would probably go to haikum or like maru, something like that, and not chocolate. Chocolate still is not the best out there, but it is definitely more flavorful than the fuyu right next by. So astringent persimmons are great to grow. Um, chocolate, more complicated, but rewarding. I hope you enjoy this uh, short five-minute video. Um, see you next time.